myself Shweta Gohil and welcome back to the channel. Hope you all are fine. Please subscribe the channel if you have not done yet. Today we will see a new subject which is named industrial electronics. So without wasting a time let's move to the contents of today's session. We will see introduction of the subject which is industrial electronics. We will see the scope of the subject. We will see what do you mean by thyristor and its types. So let's have the introduction of the subject. Industrial electronics is a branch of electronics that deals with power electronic devices such as thyristors, SCRs, ACDC drivers, meters, sensors, analyzer, load cell automatic test equipments, multimeters, data recorders, relays, resistor, semiconductor, transistor, waveguide scopes, amplifiers, radio frequency circuit boards, timers, counters, etc. It covers all the methods and facets of control system, instrumentation, mechanism and diagnosis, signal processing and automation of various industrial applications. The core research area of industrial electronics includes electrical power machine designs, power conditioning and power semiconductor devices. So simply industrial electronic refers to equipment, tools and processes that involves electrical equipment in an industrial setting. This could be laboratory, automotive plant, power plant or construction site etc. Industrial electronics are also used extensively in chemical processing plants, oil, gas, petroleum plants, mining and metal processing units, electronics and semiconductor manufacturing. Now the scope of industrial electronics ranges from design and maintenance of simple electrical fuses to a complicated programmable logic controllers that is we called as PLCs or solid state devices and motor drives etc. Industrial electronics can handle automation of all types of modern day electrical and mechanical industrial processes. Some of the specialty equipment used in industrial electronics includes variable frequency counters and inverter drivers, human machine interfaces, hydraulic positioners and computers or microprocessor controlled robotics. Now let's move to the most important component of industrial electronics that is thyristor also known as SCR. The definition of SCR or thyristor is it is a semiconductor device that performs action of switching as well as rectification. It is a four layered three junction device formed by combination of alternating P and N type semiconductor material. Thyristor is a word formed by merger of thyratron and transistor as it exhibits rectification action of thyratron as well as controllability of that of transistor. It is three terminal device that is anode, cathode and gate. For conduction to take place gate trigger pulse is necessary. Unidirectionality is a major property of thyristor. This means that it permits flow of current in simply one direction. Though there exists a large classification of thyristor, however, SCR that is silicon controlled rectifier is considered to be the most crucial member of that belongs to the thyristor family. Thus, 
SCR is generally referred to as thyristor. Now let us see types of the thyristor. The device that come under thyristor family are given below. In which SCR stands for silicon controlled rectifier. DIEX stands for bidirectional diode thyristor plus AC. TRIEX stands for bidirectional triode thyristor plus AC. MCT that is MOSFET controlled thyristor. SCS that is silicon controlled switch. SUS that is silicon unilateral switch. LASCR is light activated SCR. That's all for today's session. In next session we will learn thyristor in detail. Thank you so much for watching the video. And yes, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Take care. If you like this video, please, please, please subscribe and like our YouTube channel LJPEC and don't forget to click on the bell icon to get latest video update fast.